are some kind of hero, are you, huh? Liberating the oppressed with that you, the witch. But I see you are not a complete idiot. So you do understand, deep down. You do understand. There is no other way. Man is a beast. A beast! You just let a man run free, and it's a murder spree! Remove the restraint of power and law and everything. Dance to the law in the jungle. It's always a bloodbath. A total bloodbath. There must be power. Must be law and order. Belief. Civilization. Don't you see? Because without law, without God, everything is permitted. When they bring a new slave in, he's a total savage. They live in fucking caves now. Forgot everything. What do they get? Life of a hungry ape. A bunch of sickly kids and a death in a demon's stomach. That's it. I gave them purpose. They work. They serve. They build. They build a civilization. And you... You want to destroy it, you motherfucker. Destroy my civilization, you piece of shit. Fuck you. You get what I mean. Get that car while you can. I'm getting a drink. Young men, we are civilized people. Let us keep our weapons out of the picture. I'll put that weapon away, will you? We don't want to give the guards any ideas, you know.
breaking up. Hey, don't get all tense here. If we wanted you dead, you'd wake up dead already. No two ways about that, huh? <laughs> Hell yeah! So don't you worry, pal. Sal wants to make you offer, so listen. <laughs> so, here we meet again. Did you forget how you knocked me out back then? I sure remember. My head still hurts, you see? <laughs> I also remember that you didn't kill me when you could. So here you go. Eight bullets in the cylinder, you see? Cost me two tons of water, so be gentle with it. But that was just foreplay. Time for business. I figure you'd want to know why I rushed you there. Do you know our Baron? Well, I basically had him on a plate already, you see? Hmm. I spent five years sucking up to him and roughing up the damn locals for him. I even got his custom van for that service. Ah, don't sweat it. <laughs> you can keep it. I have more than one car. So, to cut to the chase, I almost lost that crazy witch on his ass. She was supposed to whack him, and I had all the preparations in place. Rast, Vach, Tiri, Tamki, you see? And that's the moment you guys choose to arrive at. Train and all. The Baron, with his paranoia, immediately decides that you are a new gang from the West. How to get him specifically. And all my planning goes to the shitter. Lock all the doors, triple the guards, the whole shebang. That girl lost any chance of getting close enough to him. But now I think this might even be for the better. <laughs> Besides, you just helped that girl out of the lighthouse and freed the slaves from the ship dismantling operation. Don't worry, we caught most of them by now. <laughs> but still, that was a good distraction. Now the Baron is sure you're targeting his business too. In any case, I'll be frank. Neither you nor I are interested in Baron staying alive, so I say, whack him for good. You seem to be up to the task. I can still feel the thrashing you gave me. <laughs> Consider the gun and the car in advance payment. If you do take Baron out, I'll make sure none of the boys take chasing you too seriously. Then we'll be even. If you fuck up, no skin off my back either. I'll just save the Baron from the evil gang out to get him. And he'll crown me by his own hand. <laughs> so, think about it. You still have time. Get that gun out of my sight while I'm asking nicely. Uh, I wish everybody was so reasonable. Hey, put that gun away. We're all friends here. Now we're talking.
Leaving already.
Nah, there's nobody around. Who did in... Hey, where did you go? But you take those two out first! Hey! Whose wheels are these? Right. Get ready! Watch out, people! The truck! <laughs> Don't shoot! Don't shoot! I laid down my weapons already!
As you were, everyone, the Baron has spoken. 